Hello everyone, this is LED of LED Games, and today I feel like making some predictions. There are some mysteries in the overworld of this game, and I have some predictions about those mysteries. And I hope to hear from you guys what you guys think about these predictions. Do you think I'm right? Do you have your own predictions? Let me know down below. Today I'm going to be focusing on these two structures in the overworld and what they could mean for the future of the game. We have this pagoda style and we also have this subway style. Looks like an entrance to a subway. There's also a cafe, but I'm less inclined to believe that that could be something in the future. These are the two items we're mainly going to be talking about. First things first, it's no secret that Splatoon 3 has a lot of content. I mean a lot of content and they're continuing to release content. We're about to have chill season coming up very, very soon. And with this new release, we're going to be getting new clothes, new weapons, new hats, new shoes, new maps. But most importantly, we're going to have some new game features with the inclusion of Big Run and X-Rank Battles coming out with the new Chill Season update. And these are very exciting. I'm very excited to play both of these. And today I'm going to make some predictions about how these could potentially impact the overworld or also what some of these different areas could mean for the future updates of this game. Let's walk around the overworld and see what we find. So first off, we have this pagoda style here, which, you know, actually, now that I think about it, it reminds me a lot of the excerpts from Chill Season where we had these cutie blobbies in the, in the spa, when we saw the little cutie blobbies in the spa. It looked like this pagoda style. That's very interesting. Yeah, I'm wondering now if there's like Easter eggs as I'm looking at a duck holding an egg right now. So very interestingly, when you walk up to this, there is the sound of a, a bell almost, like a bell sound. It's quite ominous. And that sound only plays when you go right up close to that pagoda. So that's going to be some, that has to be something. That has to be some sort of future update. And what exactly it means, I'm not 100% sure. My guess is that I think some of these taped off areas are going to be opening up to new features. That's my hope. You know, there's quite a few different places across the overworld that have these taped across features. And I think at some point in time, they're going to be lifted and hopefully we'll have some new options for gameplay, whether that, you know, you walk through this pagoda and then you can go play Big Run or whatever else might come in the future. Th that's kind of my guess. Either way, it's kind of mysterious, honestly, uh, especially the pagoda with this bell. I have no idea really what it could mean, but it's very intriguing. So my prediction is that this is going to open up. We're going to see this. We're going to see whatever it is that's behind that aardvark drawing. <laughs> it's going to open. At least that's my genuine hope. I think that would be so cool if this world just keeps getting bigger and bigger with the more updates that come out. Okay, so let's keep walking around and seeing what else that we find. Okay, and so this area, this area over here on the left actually, on the left of the main entrance is what prompted me to want to talk about this because I've had predictions about what could possibly be, what could possibly be down here because this is going to open at some point. It is going to open. And it's right underneath where we see this duck with the eggs. What do we think that could be? It's so interesting. It's going to be something soon. Right, and so... In the overworld, we have all these different shops, all these different places, and I have a feeling that this over here is going to open soon. It, it looks like just a regular shop, 
you know, where you would get teas or cakes, but it'd be really cool if this opened at some point. That looks, that looks good. That looks very good. I want it to be melon flavored, but it looks like it would be seaweed flavored. Something that Octolings and Inklings would like. <laughs> So yeah, this, where this blobby is hanging out, I have a feeling that this might be where Big Run is going to take place. I think this would be a really interesting place for Big Run. What's your predictions? Do you have any predictions on where some of these new updates could be? Because eventually, this over here is going to open up. And my prediction is that this here is also going to open up this pagoda, this pagoda style looking thing. Oh, I've never noticed that. There's window washers over there. That's <laughs> pretty cool. There's so many little details in this game. This is going to open up eventually and I have a feeling it will open up during chill season. I just have a feeling. And I would be really interested to know what you guys think. Because look, even if it's not going to be revealed during chill season, we're going to get future updates for this game. There's going to be a lot of things that aren't even on our radar, most likely, that are going to be revealed. And my guess is that these two structures are going to house future updates. So what do you guys think they could be? What do you think would be you know, behind that pagoda? What do you think could be leading to the subway? I, I think this is really fun to think about and what the overworld could be in the future. So let me know and thanks for exploring with me. It was fun. Consider subscribing and liking the video and I'll see you all in the next one.